taking any more photosynthesis in, so it's, it's going to die. Right. A couple of days. They said, as far as they know, about three days. Mm -hmm. It does all that energy in order to produce to the flowers to attract the pollinators. So that it can then, and then what we should have coming along is a fruit spike. We should have a if they're if they were successful, we'll have a fruit spike from those female flowers and then the fruit will have seeds inside and you will then get the corn from any seeds that are fertile we'll get some corn. And that that's what you see the, the root. So that'll take a few more months. <laughs> and we'll see whether we got I assume they know what they're doing. This is his fifth blooming here. And John has been here the whole time. So he had pollen from another source and uh, overnight they, they brought the pollen in. So then we hope to get more seeds. So why doesn't it smell? Don't know. It just wasn't strong. Because it has, it's a kind of sulfur. It has two biethyl bisulfide and trisulfide something or other. But it just wasn't strong. Just, and I know you said that Usually they keep it down there with more humid. Yeah. In a or in the greenhouse yeah. where they can control it. Yeah. yeah. Because, and we did have the doors open last night, you know, people coming and going, but it should still have sent, sent the scent out into the building, and I, I didn't really smell it. Yeah. So it got a, 
it got a name for something that didn't happen this time yeah. very dramatically. Yeah, exactly. Yeah. Is John here? John is, was, he is by the door. Yeah, he's just stepping back. Thank you.